This is Hannibal from the HannibalTV.com and I have just completed a three day investigation of Tucker House here in Clarence Rockland. This house was built in 1870 and it's said to have been haunted by Mrs. Tucker. Right now we are in the prayer room. Right next to the prayer room is Mrs. Tucker's room. Both the prayer room and Mrs. Tucker's room have been allegedly said to be haunted. Uh, there's been unusual noises in the house according to some reports. Some reports said that the piano played on its own. There's a piano on the main floor. In the three days that I was here, I slept in Mrs. Tucker's room. Various people slept in the prayer room. We had different visitors throughout our time here. I did not experience any unusual activity in Mrs. Tucker's room, nor did anyone in the prayer room uh, experience any activity in here. We did try to use a Ouija board several times over the course of the three days. The first night there was only three of us in this house. This is a very large house. Uh, the Tuckers were very wealthy people in this area. They were involved in the lumber business, uh, cheese business, and many other little businesses. We investigated the basement, the main floor, the attic, um, both in times when there was only three people in the house and when there was as many as 50 in the house. Nobody that was here during any of the three days really experienced anything unusual or even any eerie feelings. Uh, when we were using the Ouija boards, we couldn't even get the cursor to move at all. Not with males, doing it with males, females with females, females with males, doing it in the directly haunted rooms, doing it in the hallway, which we thought would be the center of the haunted rooms and kind of felt that, that would be more likely to have some activity, but no. If it was haunted at one point, perhaps that spirit has finally crossed over because you would think with the effort, and I really put in a lot of effort to try and channel something, we would have had at least the movement of the Ouija board cursor to a no. The no they didn't want to talk, but we had absolutely no movement. The only really unusual thing that I could say is when my dog first came here, my there's a part in the house that separates the servants' quarters in the upstairs from the main part, where in the main part of the upstairs is where it's supposedly haunted. At first, the first day we were in here, and a little bit for the second day, my dog was very hesitant about crossing into the upstairs area by herself, or even when I was calling her, and usually she's always right by my side. But by today, she's got over that. She's had no, no signs of any hesitation to be in the upper area. That was the only unusual thing I noticed. People say sometimes animals have senses, but as I said, whatever sense she had, it only lasted about 24 hours. All in all, very beautiful house to stay in. That's my, uh, my wrap up. Tucker House, Clarence Rockland, Ontario, not haunted.